Hey, we're I the Mighty, and you're watching punkvideosrock.com. Hey guys, Robert Herrera here with punkvideosrock.com, hanging out with the guys from I the Mighty. How you guys doing today? Great, doing man. Great. Good. Uh, how's it? Have you guys played Chain Reaction before? Uh, once before, yeah, back in February, so a few months ago. Cool. cool. You guys just signed to Equal Vision Records. Congrats on that. Thank um, you. How how did that come about? We actually uh, played a showcase here at Chain, uh, maybe six or seven months ago, right? Yeah. And, uh, well, it went well, so. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's pretty much. Uh, the okay. booker at Equal Vision, who's actually our booker now, he's one of the in-house bookers there. Okay. Kind of, uh, we gave him our music, and he loved it, and kind of, like, spread it around to the ground level of EVR, and I guess it made its way to the top, and he, that's when he came and flew out to see Any us. Any artists on the label that you guys have been listening to lately? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Pierce the Veil. Uh, super grew up listening design. to Coheed. Coheed's my favorite band, and yeah, they started Armor for it. Sleep. I'm a big fan of, even nice. though they're no longer. Sure, they'll yeah. still be around. Yeah, yeah. Say anything. Say anything. Just got signed. That's oh, like nice. one of our biggest influences, yeah, yeah. or at least one of mine. So. so now you guys are part of the whole roster. Yeah, yeah it's crazy. It yeah, it's surreal, most definitely. So how is it now that you guys are a signed band? How does it feel? Feels good. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a dream come true for sure. Especially yeah. Equal Vision because we've all been fans of that label forever. That's a, that's a good label so. to be on. Absolutely, they they've been absolutely awesome and just great people. So, Sick. you guys just uh, released uh, Cutting Room Floor, your single. Uh, let us know about that song. What what is this song about? Uh, it's it's the political song, I guess. Out of all the ones on the album, it's the most political. Um, it's kind of just bred through frustration with the way politics are run and greed. Mostly, it's what it's about. Okay, and uh, how do you guys work as far as uh, your writing process? What's the writing process of the band? Um, it's it's kind of growing a little bit. It used to be like I would write a lot of stuff, and me and he would write a lot of stuff, and we'd bring it to the table, and like everyone kind of like work it out. And uh, the newer songs, like this new EP that we're gonna have coming out in the fall, um, a lot of it was just like in the practice room. Someone would spit out a riff, and we would work on it. And a lot of it was just really, really organic. Like yeah, like really. you said, we would jam out a riff and then uh, it would just grow from there. So, so sometimes, sometimes the lyrics will come first and then we'll make music to it afterwards, cool. but for the most part I think we create the music and then I'll write lyrics too. What influences the band as far as uh, writing your music? We've got anything. Yeah, we've got quite a few different influences. Um, I mean, Brent and Ian are into like bring a lot of singer-songwriter style okay. influence to the band. Um, yeah, I, I listen to pretty heavy stuff and I mean we all do, but yeah. Chris likes a lot of like classic, classic music. So, yeah. Yeah. Cool. And you and you mentioned you're working on a on a new EP. So what's what's the pro or what's the progress on that so far? What do you guys have going uh, on? Uh, it's done. So now it's just the process of getting it released. Getting it released. Yeah. We're gonna release it basically. EVR is yeah. announcing the release date. I think in a, in a couple weeks from now. Okay. So. Do you guys have a title for it? Oh uh, yeah, it's called Karma Never Sleeps. Okay. Okay. And what else can we expect with you guys uh, for the remainder of the year? A lot of touring, yeah, yeah. yeah as no, much no as possible. Touring. Hopefully, just, so. just find us on the road. Look for yeah. dates. We're trying to hit, you know, the whole the whole nation by the end of the year. So, yeah. did you guys tour much before the signing? We uh, did, you know, regional stuff, but yeah, nothing, but, nothing extensive. We didn't get, we haven't been to the East Coast, and we haven't done a national tour it's yet. It's definitely gonna be a new experience. Oh yeah, yeah we can't Very wait for so, stuff. So, yeah, <laughs> for sure. Cool. Well, we look forward to hearing more about you guys, and you know, good luck with everything. Thank you guys want to give any last words to your fans? Thank you, thank you, thank you for yeah. everything. Yeah. Like it, this makes it worth it, <laughs> yeah. you guys. So, um, yeah. we're gonna have pre-orders for the album. I know for like two months before it comes out. So, um, try to try to do that. That would cool. be cool. <laughs> cool. Find thank us somewhere you and and make it happen. We'll get we'll like up. like us on Facebook. <laughs> and uh, if you don't have the old album, if you're just seeing this, you don't you haven't heard any of our stuff. Uh, the new stuff's a little different, but you can still download the old album for free.